Hey guys, what's up? So for today's video, we have another how to style. I am going to be styling oversized jeans in this lookbook. I have seen so many A-list celebrities and models rocking oversized jeans. To me, an oversized jean is slightly different than a boyfriend jean or a mom fit jean because those jeans, they are baggy, but they still are like a mom jean. is still very fitted at the waist and then also fitted at the ankles. So I wouldn't necessarily call that oversized. So for the purpose of this video, I styled some Tommy Hilfiger oversized jeans that I picked up from the thrift store. They are a little bit baggy around my waist, a little bit baggy on my legs, and also flared out. So definitely something oversized. For all the outfits, just remember that these outfits are merely for inspiration. You could change the outfits according to your look. Definitely never uh, this is what to dress head to toe, but this is just me showing you guys what I would wear and as always I'm gonna be re-wearing certain pieces and explaining and talking you guys through all the outfits so without further ado if you guys would like to see all my outfits then just please keep watching I think the most obvious way to wear something oversized would be to like juxtaposition it with something tighter at the top. So for the first three looks, I'm just showing you guys what oversized denim would look like with a crop top. The first crop top is from Forever 21. The second crop top was from the thrift store. And then the third crop top was also from the thrift store. And I just wore it with different accessories so you guys can see how changing a few things up will leave you with three different looks. So these next three looks are me showing you oversized denim with an oversized top as well. So for the first look, that is a t-shirt that I got from Depop and I just basically knotted it in the front. Even though I'm wearing oversized on oversized, I still want a little bit of my body to show and I put it on with a pair of Yeezys just to kind of give it kind of like that dad look vibe that's pretty popping at this time. And then for the second look, I just paired it with a black Gucci sweater. I knotted it a little bit in the front, again, just so you could see a little bit of my body. And then the third look would be something that I would definitely wear, I think, to the park or to do something really, like, I don't know, this would be on a day where it's really hot and I have my period and I just don't want to be annoyed. So I'm wearing the oversized denim with just like a really flowy nightgown, nighttime sort of tank top and then anytime that I feel like shit I just add my Louis Vuitton bag so that's the purpose of the bag. For the next three looks these are looks that I feel like are more geared to this springtime. The first look is the Forever 21 crop top with the H&M teddy bear coat and then I just wore a vintage little thrifted bag right here. The look in the middle is something that I feel like maybe a lot of people already have in their wardrobe. So it's that black crop top that I thrifted from the thrift store and then the leather jacket is from Forever 21. And since I already kind of have a lot going on, I just put simple black boots on. For accessories, I use my fanny pack and small sunglasses. But if you are a little bit overwhelmed by oversized jeans, I don't I don't think that the best idea would be to put trend on trend on trend. I think just focusing on what you're insecure about and starting to be comfortable with that is the better approach. And then for the third look, it's just a white t-shirt that I knotted and then that green cropped um, bomber jacket was also from Forever 21. I think that's another really cute look like oversized jeans, a little bit of belly and then like an oversized extremely cropped item on the top. So for the last three looks, the first look, it was inspired by Bella Hadid. I feel like I've seen her wear something slightly like the same but different. So it's just a white t-shirt tucked in so I don't lose my body so you can still see my body. And then the leather jacket that I'm wearing is from the thrift store. And then I just put on white booties and small frames. And then for the last two looks, those two looks on your right, they were totally inspired by Rihanna. I feel like Rihanna, when she wears oversized jeans, she wears like, she doesn't care about rules. She breaks all the fashion rules. 
So I feel like with the look in the middle, wearing Tim's is like super Rihanna in my eyes. And then that black bandeau top was from the thrift store. I got a cute little clutch just to make it kind of like girly and tomboyish at the same time. And then the frames that I have on are from the thrift store. And then for the last look, that's just me wearing oversized jeans with an oversized t-shirt. And you guys could basically do whatever you want. You know, there are no rules in fashion. So even though this video is showing you guys like different outfits, I wanted to show you guys all types of different outfits. So I hope I accomplish with that because if you don't like to wear tight clothing, if you don't like to be super, you know, whatever it is, then you don't have to be. Fashion is fun and you can do whatever the f pleases you. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. Don't forget that if you guys have any more like how to style or what to style items, please leave that in the comment section down below. I really love hearing from you guys. And don't forget that these outfits were merely for inspiration. If I didn't hit every single possibility, it's merely because of the lack of my wardrobe. But that's why I try to insert some inspiration pictures for you guys. Bye.